Hi there, I'm Frodo, and we are playing Battletech. Um, we're going to go and do a store mission, I think, but I just noticed we don't actually have any ship upgrades on the way. So, uh, we should probably, we should probably do that. Um, that would be nice with extra tech points, um, but we have to get the improved power card to its first. Excuse me, which is uh, 20 days. I think we're going to try and get some of these things. Um, that's only 15 days. That's only ten days. Let's say let's get this one. All right, I'll get the team on it right it's away. Only ten days, so that'll finish. Uh, that should finish before we even get to where we're traveling to. I think. Um, contracts. That's what we want. We have a bunch of injuries, but they should all be done by the time we get there. So we have to travel to Weldry. Uh, we get a little bit of money and no salvage, so I'm not sure what's up with here, but we'll uh, we'll do it. Skedaddle on our way. Um, the Highlander should be done soon. The Grasshopper should be back. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Let's see. In the deal briefing, uh, Smar brings up an open hail from neighbor ship to say her courage contacts are virulent and cost of the periphery pox, but the local government is prevent from landing and receiving medical care. Uh, but, 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 but. So we could leave them alone, we can give them some, or we can sell them some. Uh, well, I don't need the money, so I want to just give them some. Uh, so we get minus one medical point. Get plus one reputation, which is practically nothing. Hey, which is going to take a couple more days, I guess, but whatever. <clears throat> hmm. Okay, so we're gonna dock, we're gonna fly. I'm not sure if it's a one jump or a double jump, maybe a triple jump. I guess I could have uh I could have looked at, looked at that, but it doesn't really matter. Um if we pause here if we don't undock. because uh, there's a store here, so there's looks like there's more jumps. If there's something really good here might go and get it. Um, doesn't look like there is. There's a plus plus SRM. But I don't think that is good enough for us to actually leave. There's this guy with plus 10. But uh, what do we have on our... It's not done yet, is it? Yeah, here it is. Our AC is a plus plus AC with plus 4 accuracy. So I think we're just going to leave it. Uh, we'll just be on our way. Okay. Go do some more. Uh, plus one morale. Twenty days. Is there one that's shorter? That's twenty days. This was fifteen days. Costs a lot. They all cost a lot, eh? Yeah, they all cost the same. Excuse me. This one's I can't even afford that one. Um, this one's cost a lot. Don't get anything. So. Let's do the 15 day one. What was that one? The library? Yeah, 15 days. $415,000. That's fine. We're getting a little low on the finances here, but not not terrible. I believe I have a bunch of mechs I can actually sell. Uh, like some Wolverines or Quick Draws or stuff like that. Things that I don't need. <laughs> Our uh, low spirits disappeared. We have some. There's another one. Plus 10 damage. Element 10, plus 1 damage. Um, nothing else exciting. So we're just going to be on our merry way. We're going to be there shortly. Everything's going to be finished up. Shroom. Whew. There we go. Now we're actually where we need to be. Disengaging from jump ship. Let's see if there's some fun in the store. AC 10, AC 20, laser plus. Oh, gyro. Plus two melee hit. So that's the. Should put that on that. Oh, it has a comm system too. Should get that. I should get that. 
I should definitely get both of those. Mm. Yes, yes we should. <laughs> Excuse me. And we could put that uh, maybe on there, the melee one. Job's done, Commander. Okay. Uh, we haven't landed though, so let's let's do that first, and then we will visit the store. And then we shall. Uh, Those upgrades you asked for are online. Uh, not yet. I'm not quite ready for that yet. Uh, sh ship upgrades. We'll do the store first. We'll get the gyro. We'll get the. Uh, here, let's go straight to equipment. We'll get this guy. Yes. We'll get the gyro plus. So plus two melee hit. Set. So we're going to do a little bit of uh, swapping around here. Shadow Hawk. Apparently, I didn't repair it. What does that mean? Performance warning. Why is there a performance warning? Oh, because I don't have a weapon on it? No, I have weapons on it. 55. Why is there a performance warning? Why is it flashing? Okay. Info. Oh! This guy. Uh. I... Oh, I don't have SRM ammo on it. Oh, that's embarrassing. So this is... Uh, kind of useless. But... So... Where is our equipment? Plus two to hit on melee. Okay, so you go there, you go here. Um, you go here, you go here, you go here. Gyro, go here. That doesn't take any room, so that's kind of nice. Um, put those underneath, I guess. Can put it here. The comm system, we're not going to put it here. We're going to put that in something that always goes with us. So it's plus two melee hit. So, yeah. So that's improved chance to hit, right? <laughs> that's going to be three days, eh? Oh, I forgot to do the... Ah, oh, damn it. Um, I forgot to put the... Uh, I forgot to put ammo on it. So either we get rid of that... Uh, okay, let's do the gyro again. And it got rid of all the heat sinks? Not heat sinks. All the jump jets? It did, too. Because I moved them all, I guess. Like that. And then... Um, yeah, I don't know what else to put on it. We want lots of... Um, I already have one of those. I have one of those, so I can put... Yeah, there isn't really much else to put on. How much ammo is in one of those? A hundred. That's way more than I need. Way more than I need. So, what do we do about that? <coughs> so, what do we do for armor here? Just a little bit less on the legs. I don't know if I want that though, because I want to be able to DFA without taking. without losing my legs, essentially. Um, how much damage does she do? Does this one do for DFA? DFA 80, minus 20, so it's 60, probably divided by the 2. So 30 on each. Yeah. Hmm. Let's try it. Is there like a really... AC2 is too big, isn't it? I don't even have an AC2. AC5 is... 8. Yeah, I think it's like 5 or 3 or something. It's going to be too big. Okay. Let's try this and see what happens. We will uh, adjust a little bit. Oh, man. You know, I wish there was. Yeah. Let's see here if we can get right on. There we go. Okay, we're right on. Okay, do that. That's only three days now. It's better than it was before. <sighs> I feel like this one should be changed. This one has. 
four. Is that four out of four? That's max, right? For someone called a grasshopper, I feel like it should be able to jump further. What's the movement on this one? Max jump, 150. Okay. Movement, 80. Good ass. More than movement, Orion, 120. This is 0, 3. Uh, 120. What's the movement on this one? This one doesn't have any, so not much at all. Okay, so the other thing I was going to do, comms system. I think I'm going to put the comms system in... Well, this is a rangefinder. don't know if I want to put it in this one. Because this is not always coming with us. And I don't know if the dragon is always coming with us either. This one has the cockpit mod. And I'm not... I think I'm going to put the cockpit mod in... The Highlander, and then we put the comm system in here, like that. That's going to take a day. And then here we fit. We're going to put the take that out. We're going to put the cockpit mod in here because this is probably the one that's going to get shot at the most, right? So, yeah. And then we're going to put in the uh, in this guy with the Gauss. Oh, he has the rangefinder. That's right, I forgot about that. Um, hmm. I think I might change that. I could put it... Yeah. Dragon is probably coming with us. Yeah, let's put it in the dragon. The dragon isn't great, so if it's coming, we could use that. Is that the reasoning we're going to use? I think so. Right. Okay, we're okay. going to do that. Then we're going to just check out and see if there's somebody in the hiring hall. That's really good. Uh, here we have one with Bulwark and Double Shoot. That is not terribly, terribly far behind. That could be okay. I don't really need any more though, because I have so many. I wish I had someone with Bulwark and... Well, now I can't remember. I have Bulwark and Evasion and this thing. I wish I had Bulwark and Sensor Lock and whatever that thing down here is. Um, really, that's what I wish I had. Okay, Call Shot Bonus, Call Shot Bonus, Call Shot Bonus. They all have the Call Shot Bonus, actually. Even she does. So... I remember that from last mission. Okay, let's launch the contract. No, let's not. We have to do all that junk first. <laughs> we have to go six days. Well, we can manage these tasks. We can put this at the bottom. Because it does not have to be ready. And then suddenly we only have to go three days. One. One, two, and three done. Okay, now we can launch the contract. <clears throat> so I don't know what's happening in this contract, but there is a cutscene, though. And I promise you that our forces are maintaining a firm upper hand against this false restoration. Thanks in part to the support of our newfound allies in the Torian Concordat. Just today, those allies, led by the heroic Commodore Samuel Austin, liberated my own daughter, Victoria from insurgent captivity. And though the fight was hard, our new friends won the day through the strength of their courage and the virtue of their purpose. Hmm. Soon, we will end this war. And when we do, we will turn our attention back to the expansion of our industry and the betterment of our people. Long live the Torian Concordate! And long live the Oregon Directorate! Right, so because I was on vacation, I've mostly forgotten what was happening in the story. But we did capture that, uh, the, his daughter, didn't we? And um, I guess they shot somebody who helped us with that? Kyrosis? Yeah. Okay, as somebody here to discuss a long term strategy, we have the crisis to address. You've seen my uncle's broadcast, but Ostergaard did to Lord Kirstus. 
What are soldiers still doing to the people of Smithon? Yeah, we were we liberated Smithon, didn't we? <clears throat> uh, with only a small fraction of the fleet, the Torians have you dramatically outgunned. Given the chance, Iberia alone could break your army in two. Uh, well, we know why. It's because he's pissed at us, isn't it? Yeah, let's pick that one. Hmm. Not through direct confrontation. If you let Oscar bait you into attacking him on Smithon, you will die, as will Lady Rano. This isn't hyperbole, Camia. You will die if you take the field against him, and your restoration will perish with you. Uh, what do we cause me to do then? Nothing. Would you like me to sit on my hands while the Torian butcher murders the people I've sworn to protect? <coughs> Lead your army wisely, stay out of battles, you can't win. There's still hope, or you won't find them on the battlefield. Or where you can find it. Okay, the alliance between the Torians and the Directorates is tenuous, far more so than you would have me believe. Protector Calderon. Uh, Thomas Calderon succeeded his mother's aunt at Calderon. Uh, okay. No so kind of manual quiz. We could turn allies into enemies if we play our cards right. Hmm. Why would he join with us also in the first place? Okay, his nation is teetering on the brink of war with the Federated Sons, Commander Stark. And for all the con conquerors bravado, it would certainly lose such conflict. Given the circumstances, it's really no surprise that he'd accept an offer of friendship. I guess not. So said, I'm sure that we can't have a situation to an advantage. He doesn't speak. My age of digging for information will we'll open a rift between our enemies, and I'm confident they will find it. But Cameo, none of this means anything of us to go let you get. Yeah. Yeah, let's stay away from him. Yeah, I agree, stay away, but I mean, they are really mean, aren't they? Uh, okay, tell me what you mean. She's going to fight in a way that I don't expect. Uh, deploy my army against this forces on Smith Island to lead me from the front, as I have in our battles and directorate. You've convinced me that there's a risk I cannot take, and so if he expects me to come at them, Hammer, I will use a scalpel instead. I trust that your company is up for the task, Showtime. If the price is right, sure. Uh, my company alone against the Torian Assault Force? That will be an adventure later, Rano. That it will, and I'll be guiding you on the comms every step of the way. But you have my answer, Anna Maria. I won't take the field myself, and I won't redirect my army, but I'll be damned if I let Ostagard's troops slaughter my people without a fight. Your mercenaries have been one of your key advantages in the war cameo, but even this, you're putting them at grave risk. It's my middle name. But if your heart is set on return to Smithon, I am powerless to stop you. Instead, I wish you good luck and take my leave. I'll be in touch when I age no more. But please, cameo, stay safe. Can't stop it. Yeah. Alright, she promises. Okay, so I guess we're going back to Smithon. Is that what we're doing? Defense Smith on. 25 days. I just came from down there. Whew, look at this one. Four and a half. I'm not going to do that. That's going to be impossible. That's going to be like five, six, seven, eight assault ones. Uh, ooh, that's a 522. Ryan's Fate. Is that on my way? Probably not. That's a nice. I don't care so much about the paycheck, but 522 salvage. That would be pretty good. That one's a really little ridiculous. More money, though, I guess. I could do this one before I go. Destroy base. Hmm. I mean, I said I was going to do a story mission, but that's before I knew I had to fly away. Fly up and fly down again. Fly up and fly down again. This is Ryan's fate. Uh, so I can't travel. Yeah, I have to travel like that to get there. Can't travel. If I travel there, that's not really going to be any closer. Um, periphery level civilization, small population. There's not going to be anything fun to buy there. Um, this is Smithon again. So, that's 20 days to get there and 25 to get there. That seems ridiculously silly. Isn't there another one too? There's only the two? Maybe both of them are of Ryan's fate. 
I thought it was three places to travel to, but uh, no, these are both Orion's feet. Hmm. Lance load of strikes balance of mobility, durability, and firepower. For details will be provided upon your arrival. You know, we're going to do this one, and we're going to try out that Shadowhawk with all the punching. I think that's what we're going to do. And I hope we get some good stuff. We'll, we'll see how this works out. Maybe there's something good in that store, too. Probably not, but... Uh, okay, we are very low on funds. But again, I do have some mechs I can sell. So we're going to do that as soon as we get to that Shadowhawk right there. Um, oh, I'm done. Ship upgrades. Do another one of these. 450,000. They're both 450,000. And I don't really have the cash, but we're going to do it anyway. We'll do it anyway because we'll get there before, yeah, before the financial report. Ugh, <coughs> oh, I was complaining about cash again. Pokenites! Pokenite, there's his first assistant because he said it would help keep his skill sharp. He doesn't always win, it's perhaps he's right. It's, it's usually the senior stuff. It's usually the senior staff member he ropes into playing, okay? Although occasionally some other lucky crew member guesses him out to the other boss. He can't make you play. Uh, pass on the game, play casually, play to win, manipulate the game. Uh, let's just, uh, let's play casually. Ooh, plus one tech points. Uh, just friendly game, there's a tone to the shuffle of the deck, and thank god for that. Yang clicks his ambergris vermouth. Is that a drink? Yes. Put your cup and looks at his hands. His, widens, his eyes widen immediately. Ah, poker night. Keep your eyes on the cards, but you're soon pulled into a conversation with Yang with the rarity of function. Quad Max. Darius is displeased at how lightly you're taking the game, but it's not clear why until Yang notices the pile of chips you've been absently collecting all night. Wow, says Yang. I guess I got lucky tonight. Uh, Sumer taps her own small stack of chips. We're all lucky if Darius had the cards you were just flashing around. We'd owe them all our shirts. Plus one tech points. Okay. Cool. Now we got to Get there and get some cash. We're nearly broke. I know, I know, Darius. Don't worry about it. Just because you lost at poker doesn't mean you're all low on cash. <laughs> I really do hope we have a max to sell, but I'm pretty sure we do. Even if we don't, we'll just take the cash instead of the salvage. I suppose. It was like a million dollars up on that contract. No, oh, 700,000. That's enough to pay the bills. So. Okay, we're going to undock here. We're going to get to the store. We're going to see if there's anything cool. And then we're going to. Uh, Our next take is I just know, I know. Three more days. Don't worry about it. Money's only good if you use it. Okay. Uh, not yet. We're going to check the store. I'm going to sell some stuff so I don't forget after and then go bankrupt and lose the game. Uh, there's a couple of uh, really junky mechs here. It's 20 plus. Arm mod, plus 20 melee damage. The comm system. Maybe I should get another one of those. Let's see if I can afford it. Let's sell some. That's so slow. There we go. Okay, let's sell some mechs. We can sell the Griffin. Don't like it. The Kintero. I don't know if I like this one or not, to be honest. It has a lot of uh, missile slots. Um, I have another of those. I don't like the Wolverine, so we sell that. Now oh, I have plenty of money. Um, I don't need two Shadowhawks, so I'll sell that. What is good in melee here? Maybe I should, uh, wonder if there's something that's better than... This is five jump chats. Hmm, maybe this is what I should uh, turn into a... Uh, 
punching machine. I don't know. I have two panthers. I don't need two panthers. I remember I had these and I really liked them, but they're too tiny now. It's a light mech, right? So it doesn't really do much. Uh, I'm going to keep it around, though. Quick draw, trebuchet. Quick draw is better. Get rid of the trebuchet. There, now I got tons of money. So now we're going to buy again. I have to wait 10 minutes for that. Oh, no, that was quicker. Let's click equipment. We're going to go uh, get the comm system here. Buy. Yes, accept. New equipment available. I'm not sure what I'm going to put it in. Um, so this one has a thing. 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 This one does not have a thing. Nor do these ones. I could put it on this one. No, it has a... Oh, no, that's not in the head. That's in the center torch, though. Um, but I think we're going to put it in this one. Uh, let it go a day, and then we'll do the mission. Just because then we'll get... Because we're going to bring this one with us, so... Just for fun. Uh, okay. Uh, spin. I up that job you asked. All done. Launch contract. <clears throat> Now, what are we going to bring here? Um, Rangefinder. Let's um, let's not bring let's not bring the Centurion. Let's bring Shadowhawk, which we're going to put him in. I think is that a good idea? She's going to be in the. She's going to be in the long range one because she's going to stand still so that's good for the bulwark she also has the uh, that useless thing um, but she is the one with she's the one with breaching shot and I want a big gun for that which we have here but that's a very close range big gun and he also has breaching shot so maybe that's not such a good idea then I guess she could be in the. Her piloting is eight. Maybe we'll do this. Base damage sixty. Total is ninety. Um, Eighty-five. It's close. I mean, this is obviously more, but seventy-five. DFA is ninety. We don't want too much DFA because fly in we don't want to get smashed bits by ourselves. This one actually has more DFA than this one. Anyway, we'll try this. Highlander, Shadowhawk, Orion, Dragon. Uh I don't know. I don't know how this is gonna go. We could try to bring this guy too, instead of the Orion, but I don't know if that's a good idea. Maybe instead of the dragon probably. Should I? Hmm Maybe I should bring Venom. We're gonna bring Venom actually, so she gets some. Uh, she can get some uh, experience points. Uh, in which case, should I bring? Should I try this guy? I don't know. Two mechs that I don't know how we're gonna do in the same mission. That's probably not a good idea. We'll do this. I don't actually know if I did the right thing with the pilots in there on the right, on the right max. Did I? Should I put Medusa and the dragon instead? I don't know. I don't know. I haven't quite figured out all these things yet. Maybe I should just read something on the internet. Tell me what to do. Select, okay, when High Lady Kiriona Rano founded the Oregon Coalition in 2910, it comprised, comprised of only four systems. Cormodir, Itrum, Tyrion, and Goldra. Good to know. Okay. Let's get any more facts. Maybe a loading screen? There we go. Hyperpulse generators controlled exclusively by Comstar allow near instantaneous something communication, probably. 
A long-time enemy of the Iran Restoration has unexpectedly turned herself into local authorities and will now be extradited uh, sorry, to another system for trial. The local pirate organization does not want to see her testify and will try to stop her from leaving the planet. We've secured a convoy of armored vehicles to transport the criminal, but we need the extra firepower of your mechs to guarantee a safe path to the excavation zone. Is this a escort? It is. If I'd known that, I wouldn't have done it. I guess I would have known if I'd read that, but... Uh, Commander, I've heard a bit about this criminal and the things she's accused of. The pirates will do anything to eliminate her. That should be a capital T there. If we take the job, we should expect trouble. Well, I mean, it's all there's always trouble. Command interface initiated. Plus 33 morale. Currently under fire. Okay. Let's get out. Who is in... Start with this one. Uh, sprint. Enemy contact. They are being attacked. There's a vehicle. That's a mech. She's in the Orion. Who's in the uh, Shadowhawk? She is. Holy moly! She can run a, f a long way. She can see them, but she can't shoot them. But she's all about not shooting. She's gonna sprint though. Um, sprint there. Get close. On my way. Get as close as you can. I've got a okay, we have another sensor. That's a 55, a 40, and a 60 ton vehicle. She's gonna smash that vehicle to bits and pieces. Oh, she can, she can run a long way too. He, he can run a long way too. Is he going to though? Is he gonna sprint? No, nope, he's gonna sprint. Then he can stand there. Oh, that's rough terrain. Ugh. Here we go. This is Sisada. Sikada. Kisada. Kikada. I don't know how to say it. Sisada, probably. <clears throat> okay. Good to go. Oh, come on. You just short. We can DFA it. Uh, we can jump. Is that rough terrain? Yeah, we don't want to land in rough terrain. I wish we could jump and then punch. That would be something, wouldn't it? I just one am I just one short? Yeah. One short. Should've gone here. If I gone here, I would have. Um Yeah, and then she's got nothing. So hundred I take a hundred damage if I jump onto. Which would be fifty on there and fifty on there, which would take a lot of armor out of my legs. So we're not going to do that. We are going to jump to here. No, that's too far away. <clears throat> we're going to jump here. Yeah. Yeah, sure, why not? We're going to jump here and shoot this. Let's see, we got two here. Trebuchet, Wolverine, Manticore. What's in that Manticore? PPC, SRM, LRM. I guess, sure. Taking the shot. That did practically nothing, but <clears throat> not supposed to be hit, you have five add five. Okay. Here comes the trebuchet. Why are you getting hit so much? <clears throat> Pardon me. Okay, you are gonna move to here. Are we gonna oh ghost rifle and LRMs. Who are we gonna take out first? Probably that guy. With all those LRMs. That seems like a thing. I mean this one. I guess this candidate as well. Move order received. Precision strike. Where do you have the least armor? 54, 50, 34, 34. Um, should probably actually. As a PPC, that's, you know, that could be nasty. Um, I think we're gonna multi target. This one and this one. Like that. 
Target confirmed. This one also has a PPC. Ooh, there's arm. Okay, yeah. do so. You have lots and lots and lots of fun stuff. Which you're all going to use on this guy. We're going to precision strike him, I think. 54%. That's going to totally wreck him. So let's do it. Uh, I'm not even sure what happened there, but I think I got him. <clears throat> right. We're doing okay. I'm taking internal damage. Is that uh, the legs that are taking damage there? Yeah, the the one legs. Not gonna do any DFH now. DFA. Um. Can't hit that guy. From anywhere, really. That's not going to happen from there. PPC, AC 20. No, I'll shoot from there. What about from here? Yeah. Not as good chance of hitting though. I'd like to fire at that guy, because he's the one that we kind of started shooting at. That's right, we did the AC-20 PPC on this guy, didn't we? With the SRMs. This is going to be interesting. Let's see what we're going to do here. Precision strike. That's a 5% chance. That's 110 plus 80. We can do 140. We can get through the most part. We can aim for the head and hope for the best. If either one of those hit, it's uh, health. No, it's not going to kill with the PPC, but uh, let's aim for the torso. Let's see what happens. Didn't knock him over. Let's see this this melee thing. I don't know if that's working now. It's almost waiting for orders. Uh, that thing is almost dead. How much health does this have? Pretty sure this is gonna get smashed to bits here. 85 damage. Um, I wanted to try the stability damage though. I'm not going to get to do that because I'm probably going to kill everybody here. Um, I can't. How come I can't punch this one? It's appalling. I guess. Stomp on this guy. <clears throat> there. Take that. Jerk. Vehicle down. Okay. Yeah, you can shoot him all day long with LRMs. I don't mind that. Well, maybe not all day long, but for a good portion of the day, maybe. <laughs> I'll always settle for that. Um, I think we're going to multi shot. We're probably going to kill him with uh, LRMs. Did I get too close? No, I didn't. Because his central torso is very... Oh no, we didn't, because he is guarded. We didn't even... We did not even knock him over. Yep. We did hit him, though. Eight left. And he cannot... He cannot multi. But we still have him left. And he can multi. So, we're yeah, we're going to shoot at him here. <clears throat> Uh, with everything. Hey, yeah, it wasn't arm. It's unfortunate for him. Very fortunate for us, though. Um. Yep. 
multi a and b and apparently we're not going to do that because that's going to overheat us that's also going to overheat us we can do that though Yes, thank you. I thought I turned off the PPC. I guess I didn't. Did I overheat and get internal damage? Because I didn't mean to do that. I wasn't paying attention. Um, I don't know, it doesn't look like I did. Weird. Yeah. Time to show what this is. Okay, let's. So he's at zero. He's right at zero now. He's gonna do. She's gonna do 105 stability damage. Let's see how much that is. Oh, he's guarded. Left. That was not as much as I thought it was. It was two things. Which. Oh, I should have stomped on him. Obviously. Whatever. He can take it. Venom. Um, multi again. Let's see if we can do this here. Be there. <clears throat> Fire. All right. Okay, that arm. There we go. CT destroyed. That's what I wanted. Now the problem here is I'm sure I'm gonna have to do another lance before um, standing by. Ninety damage plus some short lasers. Maybe from behind? From this side. That's right, yeah, let's do it from that side. I'll probably have to do another lance here to fight, and uh, my Shadowhawk is already quite damaged. There we go, CT destroyed. Those lasers. Got him. <coughs> Okay, now we're gonna walk. Uh, this is the Shadow Hawk. Copy that. Ten four. Position confirmed. This is the Shadow Hawk. She's gonna want to be close to where they're gonna attack from, which could be anywhere. I'm gonna guess it's down here, though. There's lots of room down here. The Orion Dragon. On my way. Do we all have to? No, we don't all have to be in there. Keep them alive. Okay. They are right there. Hostile reinforcements right down there. Yeah. Oh, have I played this mission before? I have. I think I played this map before. I'm pretty sure I have. Now that I realize it, it looks very familiar. Showtime! I'm here. I don't see anybody. She's going to just move. So I don't want her to get injured. <coughs> don't drive past me. Donkeys. I'm right I'm still behind you. Can't catch up with you guys. I can jump though and jump down probably, but still. Um uh, Guess that's what we're gonna try and do. Standing by. Waiting for orders. Medusa. No, we're gonna do Behemoth. We're gonna do her first, so he, she can sprint into. Coordinates received. Okay, then he is gonna jump. Um, uh, here. It's a jump to get out of there, but I'm okay with that. No, that's too close, actually. Let's jump here. Still has a jump to get out, but. Well, this is the extraction point. Where is? Where are where are they coming from? I don't know. Is 
doesn't say. Last time it was up here, so I'm assuming that's where it is now, too. I copy. Okay, Shotan, you're up. Um, how far can you sprint? Not very. Yes, Commander. Um, I'm there. Copy that. Okay, brace, brace. Copy that. We're pretty much okay here. As long as they don't come waltzing down the ridge here. Um, well, we're just gonna brace here. Acknowledge. Jump up there, and take a look. I don't see anything, so I think we're safe. We are going to. My dropship is inbound, yeah, so we don't want to do that. Is that? Jumping. Just uh, <clears throat> cover this area here, but I think we're I think we're fine. Short time, you're up. That's rough. So three. Let's go here. So we have four. Brace. I don't want to engage if I don't have to. I'm just gonna brace. All right, but I'm ready to this go. This is where the dropship comes down. So that guy's out. Uh, oh, okay. They were not coming until they got into the zone, I guess. Will do. You're gonna have to get closer. But two, two, three of them are in. One's almost in. These guys are gonna land here. Uh, enemy turn. Okay. Here comes a locust. Oh no, not a locust. Commander. Shadowhawk. Affirmative. Race. That was a. Okay, what do we have here? Okay, it's flicking too fast. So this is a Vindicator and a Hunchback. What do they have on here? Uh, laser, laser, AC-20. Half armor, though. That guy is the first to go. Uh, PPC on the Vindicator. And there was something back here, but I missed it. There it is. It's a 55 tonner. That's nothing to stress about. Venom. Hunchback. I can't see it properly. So I guess it's not the first to go. 54%. Um, yeah, that's gonna wreck it. Let's do it. Roger. Oh, right, I forgot. He's actually... He, was, he had a cover. Otherwise, I think I might have killed it there. Probably would have. Oh, it'd be very close. Yes, Commander. <clears throat> Let's see here. I can't see that other one. Oh, I'm not close enough. I think... That's a little bit too close, I think. Now I can only see the locust. No, actually, I can see it, I'm just not close enough. Uh, I think that's okay, though. He's got full armor, so he's gonna, he's gonna take a couple for the team here. This thing is uh, hard to hit. If I do a precision strike on it, is it easier then? It's easier, but it's not easy. Should we try for the head? We're not gonna get it. 
even if I hit it, you still need more than one hit, so. Um, yeah, we'll just do this, I guess. Not gonna hit with anything, but yeah, I missed everything. All those chevrons, that's why. What is that? Is that a hunchback? No. I don't know what it is. It's a uh, griffin. Some lasers. It's not so bad. Not worried about that. Not very particularly worried about that. Uh, a little worried I'm not going to get to this to the action in time with the Highlander, though. <coughs> Plus the morale. That's pretty nice. That means a lot of precision shots, doesn't it? I should have, uh... Should have maybe used what should we call it on him. Um, vigilance. But we're gonna jump up here, we can use vigilance on her. She's gonna get shot by a, that hunchback, so maybe we won't do that. Because uh, he has an AC20. No, we're gonna reserve her. Move her down here. And then he gets to move and he gets to move and. Oh! Okay. Uh, I'm receiving you. It's guarded now. That's really annoying. That is really annoying. Where is the AC20? It's right in the right torso. I can get really, really close to killing him. 50, 54. Why is there no chance of hitting? 75%, that's not very much. 90 on that one. That would kill him. Oh, now it's 90. Okay, so here, 50. <sighs> Flip a coin for that. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, should I go center to kill it instead? Probably a better idea. Yeah, let's do that. Acknowledged. Didn't hit it. Did make it a little unsteady though. Okay, PPC missed. That's a okay. Yes, Commander. Behemoth. So they've moved all of theirs, so if she jumps up, she's safe. And then she can uh, pummel that guy next turn. Right? Yeah, those are our blues. Uh, and that can move. Yeah, she, they've all moved. So we're going to just jump, do a little bit of shot, and then she gets to go first next turn, I think. Or the locust goes first, I guess. But. See, I can't shoot him. Can't get the locust. We'll do this one. Roger that. Soften him up a little bit on the side there before I go and punch him. Okay, Medusa, you're up. You can DFA, but you're not gonna. I think you're gonna try and. Those guys are very hard to hit, turns out. Some of them are guarded. He's not very good at shooting, is he? Let's get a little closer. That might be the pro part of the problem. I should I can actually check that. Is it? Yeah, long range plus four. That's like 20% shaved off right there. Um. Yeah, if I fly there, I can just shoot him right in the top. Right there. Maybe I'll kill him. I can't precision shot, but that's okay. Didn't get him. 
And he's still down here like a schmuck. He can get a shot off though. Can I get it close enough to shoot any of those other guys? No. That's obstructed. Okay chance to hit. Not a very good chance to hit. Uh, I think we can do that without the SRM. Seventy and seventy-five percent. We'll do it. Oish! Got some good hits there. <clears throat> the so they're all out. We got four morale, I think. Three and one. Medusa should be first after the locust here. Commander. Ah! Hit me in the head! I'm wounded. Oh, you are. Behemoth gets to do the punchy punchy here. Uh, let's see how this works out. Roger that. Just sort of heat sink. Did four unsteady damp. Four sh things with unsteady. Uh, Stability damage. <clears throat> it's not as much as I thought it would be. Hmm. I don't want that thing to attack me. Hit, Commander. It says AC twenty. Okay, I get to go here. Receiving you. Um. That is the one with the AC twenty. Yep. Yeah. I can do a shot on it, um, but probably better than this one. This is that where it is? Can't kill it though, unless everything hits. How can you can't shoot with that? This is a cult shot. This is the other one. How come I can't shoot with it? Oh, because that stupid thing is in the way. Venom. Medusa. Venom. Medusa. Go on a can't. Hmm. Yes, Commander. She can do double. Like that, I guess. Can't knock him down though. And he gets to go next, doesn't he? Yeah, he's next. He's gonna do. He's gonna make me very upset. I guess I can move. Move over here, shoot him. That's too close. That's too close. That's height. I guess that's what we're doing. So I don't wanna. I don't want to let him get off the shot. Um. Better to shoot him there, actually. Higher percent chance of hitting there, but it's pretty low anyway. I guess we'll go for the AC-20. Does he have any ammo? Because if I get the ammo... Is that all the ammo he has? Because he can't shoot without ammo, right? Is that a thing? I think so. Because this one, if I hit it, it's gonna... Actually, I need to hit it with more than just a ghost rifle, but... But I'm gonna go for that one. Targeting for an alpha strike. Oh right, he was guarded. Forgot about that detail. Standing by. Oh, he gets to shoot too. <clears throat> right. Well, I can actually probably knock him over then. We're gonna try from this side, because that's where he's gonna lose an arm. Or actually, both sides. He's close to losing an arm. From this side. Not that guy, not that guy, this guy. Hmm. Well, that is a tragedy.
That is a tragedy of epic proportions. This makes me incredibly sad. That was such a waste. Didn't do anything. <clears throat> Somebody's gonna get hit by. It. Nope, he guarded. Well, that doesn't make me sad at all. That guy's gonna be. He's gonna be sad. Or should I jump up and then I can flame him? Is there a point in flaming him? He's almost dead. Is there a point? There's always a point in flaming. Let's do it. I got a head hit. Didn't kill him though. You're gonna be very sorry one day. I'm gonna punch you. Okay, Behemoth. You're gonna punch him again. Hit him in the same place if you want. Got the torso. There we go. Lost his guard and steady. That's where he's lost his guard and whatever. He's gonna run and hide. Oof! She didn't move though, so she was guarded. So she only took 50 from that AC20. I'm receiving you. I bet you are. No, you're gonna just stand where you are, even though. Um, who are you gonna shoot at? That has to go through his arm first. That should be able to, might be able to take him. Fire and all oh, right, he was guarded. Okay, I gotta pay more attention to that. Hmm. I think you're gonna do melee because you are. You are, um. You're really hot. Very, very, really hot. But who are you going to melee? This guy with the PPCs that hasn't moved yet? You need to get attacked from behind, but you have full armor. What's the worst that could happen? So, attack from this side means he's going to punch that good arm there. I mean, this is the guy, then. Which means punch right here. Yeah, yeah, I'm okay with that. A couple of lasers and stuff, too. So if we don't that was the leg. If we don't hit the center torso. We hit the center torso. Oh we did. We did. We got it. There we go. Excellent. He's next. <clears throat> we can just stand here and shoot, can we? Hunchback. Turn off the PPC, then we have plenty of heat. Uh, they're both gonna shoot on the side where they have most armor. Which is unfortunate, but. Is this better? No, I don't think so. Uh, let's do it. There we go. Just smash that. Plus three morale. Okay, who's first? The locust. Watch the flank. Watch the flank. Yeah, that's not really gonna. Not too worried about that. Behemoth. She needs to sprint and run and smashy, smashy. But there's nothing to sprint and run and smashy. So. Shoot this guy, I guess. Target confirmed. Hello, guy. Uh, this this whole experiment with the Shadowhawk didn't really work out. Gotta be honest. Not really what I had in mind. What I was hoping for. That's too close. That's also too close. So we gotta, we gotta jump further away, I suppose. Or, 
How are your legs looking? 54. 190. That's a little much. What's the odds of hitting? Waiting for orders. So it's only 60%. 70%. Yeah, we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. We're not going to DFA. 75. 40. Okay, let's do Medusa first because. He's going to smash this thing. Let's do it in front. On it. Time to get physical. Holy moly. And that's the end of that. I'm here. I can't. What am I reserve? So it's just the two of them left, so. Um, do you want to move? Move here. Can you flame? Yes, you can. Oh, but okay, so if I jump, I can't walk because I'm. If I jump, I may not be able to use the PPC. That's okay. I'm okay with that. That's overheat. Not overheat. Overheat. <laughs> it uses so much heat. Okay, let's do it. That should get up. Yes. A little bit overkill, but it's fine. It's fine. Cool. Mission. <clears throat> that was the end of that. Then we'll probably head to Smith on after this. Got a little bit of extra cash. Let's see what we get for uh, Shadowhawk. Is going to need some repairs. Venom got a little bit of XP, so that's good. So the Medusa, let's see here. Vindicator, Sisada. These are all really not very good. Any good? Uh, I suppose the plus 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 is okay. Any equipment? It's a rangefinder, it's a regular one. Well, it's a plus one, I guess. It's not as good as the other ones I had, but I'm gonna take it anyway because I can put it on my long range people. I um, guess I'll take that. And this. And. Do I care about that? I don't care about that. Mm, I don't really even care about that. I don't care about any of these things. We'll take that. It's good to have plus pluses in stock. Seems to lose them. So I did get a bunch of these things. So and uh, yeah, cool. Nine million in salvage. Guess that's good. The Big Mac. Hmm. Cool. So I think that's the end of this episode. Should we maybe take a look at our mech warriors? Hey boss, Hydroponic the garden is done. Uh, beginning experience. Yeah, we're gonna take a look at that. Let's do another ship upgrade. We're gonna do the last one of these morale ones. Then we're going to do our mech warriors. We're going to see what they have. Um, Good to go. She didn't go on a mission. Um, what can I do for you? Glitch didn't go. Showtime went. <clears throat> it's 5300. Not sure what I want him to get. Uh, Venom, I'm receiving you. she got some XP, but she doesn't have enough to do anything with it. Commander? He's still gaining, so that's interesting. Um, don't care about Spitfire right now. I'm going to do so. He can get this guy. I like this thing, Master Tactician. I wish I had 
such a lock in that and like yeah anything else I hear ya she doesn't have anything Max she's still working on getting stuff waiting for orders she's getting close to maxing out which point she will uh wonder what you get there she should be the uh, the mealy smashy smashy she could get the 20% there minus two recoil penalty then she would be she would be good for yeah, I don't know which one's better to do a bunch of these things. He may be better to go up here. You know, what? I'm just gonna leave them for now. I'm just gonna leave them alone. Uh, let's go do our <clears throat> repairs. I think we're gonna send this to storage. That didn't really work out the way I wanted it to. So, uh, okay. So repaired first, I guess. And then what do we have in storage? What do we have for heavies? have one out of three for the Zeus, the Battlemaster, the Awesome, the Victor, and the Victor. Two different kinds of Victor, so it's an S and a B. For here, we have one quick draw, and then we have just parts for everything else. So the quick draw, melee damage is, what does it say? So I don't know. That's five jump jets, though. That's that's something. Is there anything with more than five? There's not a quick draw down here. That's a five A. What's the difference between those two? Oh, that is that's the same one. It's five A, but that one's ready. And then the uh, Kitaro movement. Beast of a machine. Hang on, so what is the one? The Shadowhawk is a medium. So if I want a punchy punchy, it's probably a heavy, is what I want. Million movements. Two of those. It's a guitar at zero. Two. Three for the hunchback, three support, seven lasers. What? Look at these things. Seven lasers, seven lasers. The awesome and the Battlemaster. The Victor. They're actually smaller than my. This is a 90 tonner. It's the biggest one I have. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure what to do with all these. Anyway, that's the end of this episode. Uh, make sure you tune in for the next one where we are going to go do the story mission. Thanks for watching.